you never go straight in. You're always missing the trick. Your opponent, if he doesn't know you, he's got to figure out if you're left handed or right handed. And you may say, well, what difference does it make? Well, it makes a lot of difference. Because I can tell you right now, I'm left handed. And when I go into match, I want to go this way because this is my power hand. This is my power hand. Jeffrey does a lot of left hand fighting. Eh? How do you serve? Now he's going, he's right to left. Same thing I did, right to left. And when we when we when we wing that person this way, I can we can feel them starting to want to go the other way. So the idea is that just let them know who's boss. You don't have to you don't have to get in this position to be superior. And you'll always see like they'll, they'll be grip fighting on that, but this is the one that they're going for. This is the one that they're going for. They would have. It doesn't have to be a competition. It could be a, uh, you could be visiting a dojo. You could be going to team training. You could do anything. Just doing general randori. But when, when Jeffrey stands, stand the other way, Jeffrey. Like, <laughs> they don't give you their arm. They stand the other way. They give you the lapel side. And that's, and you may have to feed it to get into it. Okay? So, once I've got my grip, let's say I want to go right now. Okay, so now Jeffrey's going to go right. He's, he's stiff arming me. So I can't really do anything from this grip. Or sorry, if I'm down here, it's stiff arming you. I find it very difficult. So I go on top, and then I do my heel palm. That's where my strength is. As we said the night, this is weak. You want heel palm. You want to come down. Just. Walk around with your partner a little bit, figure that out. Bow in, walk through the circle a bit, go for the recovery. 